Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. I'm so excited to have you here. If this is your first time being here, thank you for coming to my channel. And uh, I hope you stay with us. And if this is not your first time, welcome back. Um, I'm so glad to have you back in or on my channel. So um, today's video, as you can see by the title, is all about my Sweet 16. <music> Um, so I did a pretty untraditional uh, Sweet 16. It wasn't anything crazy. I didn't have a big entrance. It was literally a barbecue in my backyard and it was the best it could have been. Um, we had to reschedule about three times, four times over the course of six months because of COVID. Um, so it did fall on the beginning of September and we got to have all of, almost all of my family and friends here if you couldn't come because of the changing dates. Um, but I just wanted to run you through the whole entire thing so you can either get some traditional or untraditional ideas to replace the traditional things to do at a Sweet 16 or just to hear about my experience. Um, so I'm going to walk you through everything. So the first few nights before the party, we were blowing up balloon towers. And for my first two days of school, they actually landed the two days right before the party. Um, so I barely got any sleep for, the, for those two days of school, but I didn't really care. But blowing up tons of balloon towers, it was so easy. We got one of those little like $10 balloon blower upper things off of Amazon and it worked amazingly. Um, so we had tons of balloon towers. You'll see it in my, um, in my picture montage later. Uh, we had tons of balloons everywhere, just in towers, and I can't even explain to you how much we had. So, it was outside my backyard. My cousin DJ, he's an awesome DJ. If you ever need a DJ, I would love, 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 love to request him to or refer him to anyone else. If you want, I could um, add to the description box below uh, his all of his tags on social media. And we had a barbecue or barbecue food, food and we had some servers there just to make our lives a little bit easier. Uh, we played games, we had cornhole, we had, my brother had I think a wiffle ball game going out in the front yard, we had cup pong, ping pong, um, we had like dance party, we had keep up the balloon, uh, we had tons of different things. So for food we had like wings and all the all, every barbecue thing possible. I got an ice cream cake from the cake I work at for dessert. I made cream puffs. Oh, we had a candy bar. That was another thing. And so I didn't do an entrance. I pretty much greeted everybody as they came in. That's one of the sweet 16 things that I didn't do. Instead of 16 candles, and this is a big one, I did gratitude cards. So my favorite number is eight, and I didn't have that many people to give them to, so I only did eight cards. And so instead of a candle lighting, because I didn't want all the attention on me, it ended up being on me anyway, but I thought it was way more personal to write out the like little speech on, the, on a sheet of paper. And so this is my brother's. And then this is actually, I painted it with watercolors, and then it says his name on the top, and then it says thankful and grateful, and then it says love Morgan. So, and it's like cute little tied together and everybody got one that I did a card for. Uh, I did lose it, physically lose it, um, doing my mom's. I did cry and I wasn't able to get through it and they were, some of them were so long. Um, I kind of gave the short and sweet version of most of them so they weren't all the, like, the normal things. And I actually didn't get too many pictures and videos of this day just because, I don't know, we were more way more in the moment than anybody was taking pictures so I didn't get tons. But uh, there will be videos and pictures 
spurts, like swirled around here and at the end of the video too. Uh, I think there will be more pictures and videos. So watercolored this, tie dyed it. I did eight of them and I gave them to the closest people in my life. So instead of uh, 16 candles, you can also do your candles instead of like literally lighting random candles. You can light the candles on your birthday cake as long as you don't have an ice cream cake, but I did, so I did this. Um, I'm trying to give like other ideas out here or something creative and cute like that with the crafts. I might make a whole separate video on this or just replace the one that I have now just because this is kind of last minute and I didn't really think this video through the right way. But um, some other ideas that you can do instead of regular t Sweet 16 traditions, like I said, like the ones already, instead of doing a daddy-daughter dance, you can either just pick a song that your DJ or whatever plays and say, hey, can I dance with you? And so it doesn't have to be a big public thing. Or you can do a different type of dance. So this is what me and my dad were, was gonna do. We um, were going to make a mixture of all of our favorite songs that we have together and then just make like a choreographed dance so it wasn't this weird like slow dance the whole time. Um, we actually had it all planned out or I had it all planned out but it ended, it and didn't end up working out. Um, so at la the last minute we were going to take that song that's been very popular on TikTok re recently, Fancy by Walker Hayes and I was gonna teach him the TikTok dance, but he didn't think he could get it in time with like two days left. So we didn't end up doing that, or we thought of dances that already have like a choreographed thing so it's set and you don't have to worry about just awkwardly sitting there and standing there. We did that. Um, instead of gift bags, I had the candy bar. I did not have a court because I did not have this giant opening thing. So I don't know what you do in place in that. I guess you guys, you could be like, hey, you guys would be my court if I had a court, but. I didn't. I'm trying to think of all the other things I did. So we danced, we had a fun time. Um, that was pretty much it. It was a very, I just didn't have tons of pictures and videos of it. We sang happy birthday, all that stuff. And it was a really cool night. Um, so I had tons of fun and I hope you like those uh, like sweet 16 traditions. And here is a giant video and picture montage of the night I had and kind of the design in my backyard and um, all the pictures of what we did, especially during like my little speeches for these cards. Um, and yeah, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, uh, subscribe, like, send post notifications, and um, I'll be back next week at Thursday at one o'clock, and I hope you watch my videos. So see you guys. <laughs>
has you back. We love you, Dick. Hi. Yes, of course we made those. What do you have? What kind of message you have for Morg? Happy birthday, Morg. I love you.